Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I'm Pineapple Sims and today we are doing another house build. So this house is probably gonna be called what I name all of my other houses, which is family home or something like that. So this is a speed build of, of a family home. It's got two bedrooms, one and a half bathrooms, and it's got like, I've never done this before, but I included like a little hallway. I don't know, I don't think I've ever built a hallway. I usually just attach rooms to other rooms instead of have like a hallway. I don't know, this build was kind of plain. Um, I wanted to do a house really badly, but I didn't have time to do like a proper house. So I just kind of like, hey, I should do a, like a kind of, <laughs> it's, it's not decorated the best, but I did try, I do kind of like the more simplistic thing to it, like how I didn't add a bunch of stuff because as much as I love clutter in houses, since I needed to like take a break and make it a little bit more, I, I don't know the word for it. Anyway, so that's me talking about this build. But anyway, how was your guys' day? My day, ooh, it was a lot. So I got like no sleep and I'm like falling asleep as I'm doing this voiceover right now. So sorry if I like stumble over words, like really tired. <laughs> So I had this project to do for my English class that I, of course, saved to the last minute because that's the type of person I am. And I was gonna do it. And then I was like, you know what I should do right now? I should go and look at all of my old accounts that I had on Twitter because I used to make Twitter accounts as a hobby when I was like an O2L stan. You know O2L, our second life, you know, JC Kalen, Connor Franta, all them, yeah. I used to make like Twitter accounts for them and I had like an Acacia Brindley account at some point. I don't know. And so I found all of these accounts and I just privated them <laughs> and changed the at and everything was fine. But that's what I did. So I was doing that for like an hour, just kind of seeding through all of my old accounts because I found all of my old emails and then tw I logged in with them using like, yeah, because I remember passwords for these things. <laughs> oh man, it was, it was a fun time. I found a bunch of old repressed memories that I didn't really want to dig back up, but I did. <laughs> anyway, yeah, and so then I had to, I was like, oh shoot, it's like 1130 and I still haven't finished this project yet. So I stayed up, finished the project, and then I got to English class and took a three minute nap while she was reading a book. <laughs> well, okay, so we have like an independent, I say in quotes, reading book that we have to read and then we get tested on it. Um, it's not really independent because everyone has to read it. I don't know what to call it. It's like we all have to read the same book for this class, but she like has us, has us read it on her own. <laughs> I don't know. We were assigned this book and she was reading it to kind of like help us understand it, I guess. And I took a nap while she did that, which caught up on my sleep, kind of, not really. So I was going to go to bed early tonight. I think that was the goal. After this, I'm going to shower and just fall asleep. Like, I, I can't do anything else. I'm gonna die. I woke up at 6 a.m. and then tried to sleep in later but couldn't fall back asleep. So I just kind of like, uh, and then I like, ugh. And I have to walk a bunch every day. I, I'm just complaining at this point. Um, but I have to walk to my bus stop, which is far, far away from my house. And I was like dying. I was listening to my falsettos and just like, <laughs> wishing I wasn't alive. Just kidding. That's a little far. Um, <laughs> but yeah. So, and then I was walking back from my bus stop and just dying. Here's the thing. It's really hot where I live and it's so humid outside. It was 92% humidity today. It was 92% humidity. And it was only like 80 degrees the whole day. But the humidity was just too much. It was too much, man. And so... I, I need to walk to my bus and it's super hot out, but I get to my classes and they're all like freezing cold. So what I do is I wear a shirt and I walk to the bus stop with, with the, just the shirt on and I have a hoodie in my backpack that I just bring with me. Here's the issue. I get to the bus stop and there's sweat stains and then I put on the hoodie when I like get out of like when I get off the bus and get to my school. All right, did I say take off the hoodie? Put on the hoodie. I don't know what I just said, I'm tired. <laughs> but I put on the hoodie when I get to school and then I go to my class and it's freezing cold and the hoodie, just, 
and then there's, there's sweat stains, and I feel gross and disgusting, and I hate it. I, like, I love walking to the bus. The bus walk, I'm complaining about it, but it's not that bad. I love, just, I like walking, and just being alone, that sounds sad, but I like just, you know, walking, looking at nature, all of that fun stuff walking to the bus stop provides, yes. It's just, I, I wish it wasn't so hot. Come winter, I'm gonna be complaining about how cold it is. <laughs> just you wait for that. Just you wait, just you wait. Sorry, had to throw in a reference there. But just wait for winter when I'm complaining about how cold it is, even though it's probably gonna be like 70 degrees at the most. Um, and I'm gonna be like, I wish I would've, I wish I wouldn't have taken for granted those hot days during the fall that I was complaining about. <laughs> just, I wish it was winter so that I could just, uh, just a lot, you know? This is, wow, yep. <laughs> anyway, so that's my complaint, I guess. I don't know. And then I was just, I was trying to listen to music while I read my book in English and my teacher kind of like snapped and I was like, no, I'm not listening to music. I just have the headphones in. She was like, okay, but can you please take them out? So she, she, she believed it, okay? She believed it, which, yes. <laughs> but I just, uh, and the thing is the night that I had before, uh, you know, my, sleep, my sleepless night, it wasn't great. You know, it wasn't just the English project keeping me up. Uh, just a lot was going on, you know, and I just wanted to like listen to my music and then my English teacher was like, mm, no. And yeah, but I did take a nap during English, so I guess that makes up for it. I, <laughs> I don't know what I'm on about anymore. This video, we're about halfway done with the video. So, you know, that's cool. Should I talk about my classes? My sixth period is nice, I guess. It's my math class. I have two math classes. Uh, not because I'm a nerd, it's because I'm required to, because of the level that, of math that I'm in. I have to take two of them. Uh, my sixth period is my second math class, and it's fun. The teacher's nice. Um, I want to say his name because I want to talk about his name and why it, like, triggers me. <laughs> Um, but I'm kind of scared to. I'm not going to. Let me just tell you. Reminds me of Dream Daddy. Uh, take that as you will. It's not him that reminds me of Dream Daddy. It's his name. Um, just figure that out in your own time. But yeah, so. <laughs> Ooh, and then after that class, I go to lunch, which is always a good time. Uh, I usually just bring a sandwich to lunch and I'm fine. I don't know. I, I love talking about school. See, the thing is, when school starts, school is the only thing that I have to talk about. Because I, I do nothing during the school year other than school. Like, I don't hang out with people except on, like, Fridays on occasion. Because um, I don't really, like, hang out with people. I don't know. I'm just a sad little child. But <laughs> um, during the summer, I actually, like, talk to people, right? And so I have, like, better things to talk about. But during the school year, I just... All, my whole entire life revolves around school, so I can't really talk about anything else. Like, nothing exciting has happened to me in the past few days other than school. I got on 100 on my test in Japanese. <laughs> That's exciting, right? Still school-related, but it's fine. Uh, what, what, exci what exciting things have happened? Oh, I started selling my old toys on eBay. Um, that's an interesting fact about myself. I'm trying to save up to go to New York with my friend, and in order to do that, we gotta make money. So I'm selling my old toys on eBay, which I had. I have a bunch, a bunch of Littlest Pet Shop toys, and uh, those are selling for like a lot. And so I put them on eBay, and I'm praying with everything in me. I'm not even religious, but here I am. I'm just hoping that we get some sales on that because I want to go to New York and I need the money. <laughs> the money. I'm trying to go to New York with my friend for our birthdays because our birthdays are like two months apart and we were going to go like in between our birthdays because my birthday's in May, her birthday's in February and we were going to go during spring break which is in like April, maybe late March. So it's like, hey, why not? And she's never been to New York and I've been five times. So I don't know, I'm just 
we we started this whole thing and we can't back down now, you know? So, <laughs> hmm. Would start a GoFundMe, but I don't really have like a reason and I don't want to like ask for money. <laughs> I've, GoFundMe has actually been something that's crossed my mind. Don't you worry. <laughs> Didn't actually end up starting a GoFundMe. No one would donate though, so it's fine. <laughs> Wouldn't benefit even if I did start a GoFundMe. <laughs> anyway, yeah, so that's what I did this weekend. Ooh, I played Kahoot with my friend Dominique, which was fun. Um, we went on Discord and played Kahoot, and then we invited people that follow us on Twitter to play with us. But the thing is, <laughs> here's the catch. They didn't know the questions or any of the answer choices. They just had to guess, which I found hilarious. We were like laughing because there was a question that was so simple and only Dominique and I got it right <laughs> because no one knew what the question even was. I don't know. I found it really entertaining. Um, but yeah, that was what I did. I forget. Wait, when was that? It was not yesterday. Monday? Was it? Su it was Sunday, wasn't it? Yes, it was Sunday. Yeah, it was Sunday. I played Kahoot with my pal. <laughs> yep, Kahoot is always fun. Did I mention that I played Kahoot with people in my group chat? And the person who was hosting the Kahoot was taking too long to tell us the questions and any of the answer options. <laughs> and so we <laughs> they gave up at some point and they just started, um, they just started typing. <laughs> they were just like, okay, I'm just going to give you the answer. I'm going to tell you the color to click. And they would take too long to type in the color. And so they would, <laughs> the question would end and the and they, after the question ended, they would, they would finally be done typing in the color to click. <laughs> and it was so funny. Oh man, playing Kahoot with your friends is always a good time. If you ever want to like do something with your friends, play a Kahoot with all of your buddies. It's fun. I promise. It makes for a good time. Um, but yeah, so Kahoot has been taking over my life. Don't know about you. Uh, have I done anything else interesting? I've done nothing mildly interesting for like the past while. <laughs> So, you know, Kahoot is the extent of everything that I've done recently, which is kind of sad to be honest. I don't do much. I really don't. I went to the elementary school. I went to my old elementary school, actually. It's like right across the street from my house. And I went there with my friend and we did like a mini photo shoot type thing. We took like selfies and then we took pictures of each other. It was fun. Uh, now I actually have decent pictures of myself, which is <laughs> nice. Usually all my pictures are just jokes, but actually got some decent ones in there for once hey but yeah so that's what i did that on saturday i think which was nice i also okay so i started watching falsettos because i <laughs> i found a bootleg on youtube uh and there was it was separated into two different videos act one and act two and i watched act act one over the weekend not over this weekend but a different weekend and i want to re-watch act one because since then i have gained a deeper love for falsettos and then I'm gonna watch act two after I rewatch act one. I think that's part of my weekend plans because I'm not doing anything this weekend. Sometimes I'll like hang out with my best IRL friend on Fridays, um, but she has plans. I know, right? She's all I have, but yeah. So <laughs> gonna watch falsettos probably this weekend. So yeah, uh, so far act one, so good. I love Andrew Randalls. I love Anthony Rosenthal. I love Christian Borrell. I was, <laughs> just everyone in falsettos is great anyway this video is coming to a close so make sure to leave a like and comment because it makes my day and subscribe if you haven't already because i post fun things here all the time and i'll see you guys in my next video which will hopefully be soon so bye everyone